Hi everyone, welcome to Geek Decoders YouTube channel. Today I am going to do tutorial number 38 which is using switch dex function with different column values. So that is the uh, topic that I am going to cover today. So if you are visiting my channel for the first time, please subscribe to my channel uh, and keep in touch with more Power BI videos. So here I uh, am in the Power BI dashboard. So my data source contains sales person, item, sales value, sales date and feedback. Uh, this data sheet is uh, uh, there that you can download. I have mentioned the link in the description section. Right, so now we see the method one of using the switch statement, switch dax function. So this is the most straightforward way. So you can create a new column for the testing purposes. Right, so you can write here switch test the column name and you can here write switch so uh, when you add switch so it mentioned the expression value and all the uh, parameters that is required so here I have I will mention uh, sheet feedback as the expression so when the value 1 so then I say value is equal to 1 marks then the result should be very low likewise I will add so value 2 is let's say 2 2 marks then I would say low likewise I can add for all the five uh, feedbacks that I have so here I say low then here uh, if it is three I would say average here I would say good and then else I would say very good right so let's see how my uh, new color will looks like right as you can see now three marks is average now as you can see I have uh, written the straightforward switch statement so accordingly my values are displayed in the new column right now I will use switch statement for different column values and also the expressions so for that I will create a testing column right, which I rename as switch test2 so here I use switch and here for the expression I will say true right and I can write the expression so first I will use sales value column so I can say sales value greater than 200 I can say better right and then I will use another column I will say sheet feedback equals to two marks then I can say low then another expression type of uh, thing I will add here I say search find text I would say 5 and then uh, within the text sheet feedback start in position 1 and if the value not point it will be 0 and if it is equal to 1 then that means the value is written if they found if the search function found 1 then you have to return let's say we call it as uh,
rate something like that anything that you can output and else you can say uh, no something like that so here as you can see I have used different column function this is one column and this is one column and also some sort of expressions like search and you can use different expressions as well with the switch right let's see how our value would look like right so as you can see now uh, first thing is better so if the value so it will go to the first one first so if it is greater than 200 it goes to better and then marks 5 so let's say marks 2 so it goes to here so here there's a 1 and uh, likewise so it go sequentially first it will check this one then this one and this one then it goes to unknown so this is how you use expressions as well as multiple columns with switch statement in power bi so thanks for watching my video and if you enjoyed please share it with your friends and please subscribe to my channel for more power bi videos thank you